in the crib. Are your brothers in the crib? P. Who's tooting? A baby. She's just it laying there like. This is my life. <laughs> Unfazed. Doesn't care. <laughs> oh my gosh. Just another day. I've tuned in and farted. At our house. Going crazy in the summer. Good morning, you guys. I have not done, like, a vlog vlog in a long, long time. Anthony and I are back from our trip in New York. It was so, so fun. I took a lot of, like, short clips during our time there, so I'm sure I probably made a vlog into that. But we are back and slowly getting back into regular life. Anthony's at work today, and I'm with the kids. And we're just trying to survive <laughs> summer. It's been about a month of summer now. We have less than two months to go. Slowly getting there. Grayson goes back August 15th. And we are... And we are... And today is June 25th. Funny enough, today marks halfway to Christmas. I didn't want to think about that, but... There it is. Uh, Avery just woke up from her nap and both boys climbed into her crib and now they're giving her, what do you call those? Raspberries, I think? No, flubbers. Flubbers, I think is what Anthony calls them. Yeah, flubbers. So anyway, yeah, the kids had a great time. My parents stayed at our house and watched them while we were gone. Anthony and I had an awesome time. So sad that it had to come to an end, but back to real life what's going on today not too much we are actually going to go to an event tonight with my work um it's just kind of like a employee morale party um and it's at a local park it's every year in june so we are gonna go i'm gonna take all the kids because anthony is at work so i don't know how much i'll be able to help out at this party but we'll see so we are gonna go it's also supposed to rain so i'm hoping the rain holds off um, but yeah, so we've got that today. So maybe I'll film a little bit of that. Um, trying to think what else is new in life since I've last talked to you, which I can't even remember the last time I've talked to you guys. Not too much. I mean, every day we're just going to the park, going to the library, playing outside. The boys have been really into painting, doing sidewalk chalk, all the normal summer things. Um, so not too much going on. We actually have a pretty chill July coming up, so I hope I survive it. <laughs> June always seems to go by fast because we have like sports or vacation or it's like my birthday. I just always feel like there's lots going on and then I feel like July drags. It's like the hottest part of the summer other than like August I guess can get kind of hot and we usually don't have much going on. So I'm not looking forward to July, but... I like the heat in July. There's new things with Avery. She now has four teeth. She's got two on the top and two on the bottom. Also, she can now clap. So super happy about that. Wonder if I can get her to clap on camera. Let's see. Avery, can you clap? Clap your hands. Yay! Yay, Avery! So yeah, she can clap on her own, clap on command, that's huge. She also can stand at our ottoman all by herself for a couple of seconds, which is awesome. And she wants to just stand all the time. She wants to pull up and stand. Um, still hasn't crawled yet, but we're working on it. So she's slowly getting better every single day. And Grayson and Porter, they're about the same, just driving me crazy bananas every single day. But what else is new when you have young kids? And cuckoo bananas. Cuckoo bananas. I signed the kids up for swim lessons round two. They just completed the first session. It was basically like all of June. Now the second session is all of July. So we're going to do that starting next week. The boys have really enjoyed swim lessons. 
Um, they're both in different classes, but they're at the same time. So I'm able to just sit there and watch them. They used to be on Sundays. They aren't offering them on Sundays anymore. They moved it to Mon- no, they moved it to Tuesday. So I'm gonna have to take Avery with me, but that's okay. We'll just watch and cheer on brothers. And what else, Avery? What's new with you? Huh? Can you clap? Say yay! <laughs> Smile, show us your teeth. What about what's <gasps> new with me? Where's your teeth first? What about what's new with me? What's new with you, Gray? What's new with me? Gray had vacation Bible school last week while we were gone in New York. How was vacation Bible school? It was awesome, great. Stuff. Awesome, great. Mm -hmm. We joined a new church, so Grayson did vacation Bible school at the new church. And he loved it. It was every day, just in the morning. And he said he learned lots and danced lots and sang and they had fun snacks mm, mm, and played mm. games. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah. Yeah, and Avery, are you playing hide and seek? Where's Avery? Peekaboo! Avery loves playing peekaboo. <laughs> like four or five to get started with July. Grayson has two more baseball games left and then we're done with baseball. It feels like it's gone on for a very long time. He's had games twice a week, every week for yeah. like all of June and Hello. the end of May. <gasps> what happened to your shorts? You're going to be too hot in those pants. Go put shorts and, on. And... And I'll show you a few tips, like four or five, to get started with joy. And your pants are on backwards. <laughs> so yeah, as you can see, it's just chaos here, 24-7. Yeah. I gotta go feed Avery lunch, and I gotta make the boys lunch. So yeah, let me know down below if you guys are traveling anywhere this summer. Um, that was kind of Anthony and I's big trip. We're not really gonna go anywhere with the kiddos. But Sounds like we're going to do Florida in March. So that'll be our next vacation with the kiddos. Anthony and I do have separate vacations coming up. Hang on. I am going in July for just like two days to go wedding dress shopping for my future sister-in-law. Anthony has a bachelor party for my future brother-in-law in August. And then I have a bachelorette party for my sister in September. So we have lots of like little vacations coming. But that was like our big vacation was New York. And the kids are just happy to just do things off our bucket list. Why don't you tell them, Gray, what did we what did we knock off our bucket list? What have we done so far? Um we knocked off um I'm sure we did um we did ice cream. Yep, we went and got ice cream. That was on my birthday. What else? Starts with a Z. The zoo. Yes, we went to the zoo and, and saw the animals. And I'll show you like four or five tips to get started with the one here. We also went to school. That's not on our bucket list. What else did we do on our bucket list? We, we did all the parks. We went to the park. Three parts, of course. We went to the library. Yes, we, we did. We, which we need to go back. This week, we're hoping to yes! cross off swimming on our bucket list. My brother, Peter, yes! just moved into a new yes! apartment, and that apartment yes! came with a pool. So we're hoping to use his pool this week, but we'll see if it works out. It's supposed to rain a lot this week, which is good because there's been a heat dome over Ohio. It's been, it was like... Yes! 98 every single day last week it was cooler in new york thankfully but unfortunately like my parents and the kids had to deal with like this heat dome and so anytime it's raining we're like yes bring on the rain because all the grass is dead from the heat and we need the rain to like bring down the temperature it's just been way too hot in ohio lately so anyway that's about it we'll pick it back up maybe when we go to this party tonight and let me show you a few tips to get started with July. Okay, so first, 
comfort up with a little child who's a toddler and read them a book before dry bedtime and always cover them with my yeah. blank. Yes, yes, yes. So second tip. Okay, okay. so um, let me show you a few tips to go with July today. First, cuddle up the kid or the other person with only one blanket so that they don't have to do something bad. Then, the second tip, the second tip, yes, the second tip, if you go on vacation, make sure to always put sunscreen on. Tip, top tip number three. Top tip number three. Always do every thing to play before. Top tip number four. Watch out. Watch out for diapers, they might change his bike, but they can also hurt you. Ow. And top tip number five, no big porter, respect and not do that for That's all for now. Log you next week. Bye.